Say Brakate Yahoa, Brakate O'Shea, Brakate Yahoa, Brakate O'Shea, Brakate Yahoa, Brakate O'Shea. First and foremost, we want to give all praises and honor and glory to Yahoo, Bashem Yahushe, Bashem Rakakodash, double honors to the apostles and elders who rule well at Great Millstone, and a blessed sanitation to the Akiyams in the full pan you are to push in the gospel in sincerity and truth. Shalom. I come the next lesson to feed the elect of the nation of Israel, you so called Negroes, Latins, and Native American Indian, and you confusion the face of Israelites that scattered among the heathen. Right? The 144,000 and the one third men, women, and children. Right, you Israelites who are social media prophets, barbershop slash barbershop prophets, right? Hey, the most I said go out on the highways and byways and bid them to the marriage, right? You have the invitation to share out. The invitation is the knowledge that the most I bestowed unto you, the knowledge of the holy scriptures and the understanding. Hey, nothing wrong having a conversation at barbershop. With another Israelite, let you know that he's an Israelite to wake him out, out of the confusion, the confused state that he's in. Nothing wrong with posting stuff on social media. But hey, the most I said, make your body a living sacrifice. Roman 12 and 1. Right? You understand? That is pleasing and acceptable unto the Lord. Right? It also compels us to go out on the highways and byways. Right? Do this video pestle to feed the sheep. I wish I said, if you love me, feed my sheep. Right, I would say if you're ashamed of me, I will be ashamed of you. The scripture also says in Ecclesiastes 41, if better is he that hide his foolishness than a man that hide his wisdom. You understand? Alright. So let me just let me just go into this lesson. Alright. This is Matthew chapter 22. Alright. 22 verse um Matthew 22 and 29. He said, Go he therefore into the highways and and as many as he shall find bid to the marriage right so we got to go on the highways and byways right um this is luke right this is luke chapter 14 this is luke chapter 14 for us um um this is luke chapter 14 for 16 then then said he unto them then said he unto him a certain man made a great supper and bade many and sent his servant at supper time to say to them that were bidden come for all things are now ready then they he said then they all with one consent began to make excuse the first said unto him i have bought a piece of ground and i have made and i have i and i must need to go and see it I pray thee have been excused. Many are called, a few have chosen. A lot of men have this knowledge and they, they are afraid. And like we were as well last week, towards we was on the highways and byway. And this brother he, he know he's Israelite. You know, he got the knowledge, but hey, he need he need to come and learn. You understand? He need to come and learn. And we telling him, yo, you gotta come out and you can see you can see he, he can see it within his spirit, you know. He's afraid to come out and be on the highways and byway. You understand? You can't be hiding your knowledge. You gotta come out and you gotta come out and teach. You know, my, my camp leader when he's telling me, he said, hey, you gotta come out. You know this thing, you gotta come out and teach. You understand? You know, I didn't hesitate, I went. And when I was out on the battlefield with the brothers, you know, you kinda was shaky, kinda shy, you don't want nobody to see you, you know. You gotta rebuke the demon, is that demon? You gotta rebuke that in the name of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Pray for strength fast and pray we have the spiritual we have the spirit the spirit the spiritual tools that the most high gift us to use right you understand verse 18 uh no verse 19 he said and, uh, and another said i have bought five five oak of oxen and i go to prove them i pray thee have been excused and another said i have married a wife and therefore i cannot come right so these with these do these put these put the 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 the, 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 the material stuff before the most high work. You understand? This way they do, they put this before the most high. You understand? So hey, our our first priority is teaching the gospel of Yahweh Bashem Yahushai. That's why we're here. That's why we are alive today. It's a precious gospel. Right? Hey, it's nothing there is nothing wrong talking to anybody in the Bible shop or posting something on social media. But we gotta remember the scripture say, go ye out into the highways and byways. Right? 
You understand? Um, <clears throat> don't don't put in your wife, your job, and these things before the most side. We're not saying don't work. You gotta work because you got family to take care of. You got bills to pay. You understand? We do these things, but hey, your priority, your first priority, is doing the teaching the gospel of Yahweh Bashem Yahushai to get the elect sealed so we could get the hell out of this place so our big brother Yahushai can return and destroy this wicked demonic place. Come on, be men, stand up, stand up, um, show integrity. You understand? This is a wicked demonic place. Don't hide, don't hide the light. This is a dark world. The light we have is special. It's not every man, it's not every man receive the knowledge, right? It's not every man receive the, I can't, um, I can't, um, let me get this say quick, right? Ecclesiastes chapter 6, right? So don't hide that, right? Ecclesiastes chapter 6 verse um, 22, he said, For wisdom is according to her name, and she is not manifest unto many. So wisdom may manifest unto many. So hey, don't hide that wisdom. You understand? Go out and teach. Right? We not hey, you got your you got your job, hey. Hey, divide your time. Okay, you do your nine to five, you two to ten, you ten to six, however you work. You understand? Do your do your job, pay your bill, take care of your family, hey. And make sure you got time for your how about shame your shy. You understand? To go out on the high wisdom by being be be around the Akiyamas, be in camp, preaching the gospel, doing your videos. You understand? Right? Verse um, verse 21, he says, so, so, so that servant came and showed his Lord these things. Then the master of the house, being angry, said, said his servant, go, go out quickly into the streets and lane of the city and bring him thither the poor and the mended and the hail and the blind. You understand? Let me jump to verse 23. He said, And the Lord said unto, unto the servant, Go ye out into the highways and edges, and compel them to come in, that my house may be filled. So we go out on the highways and byway. Right? This is um, Luke chapter 19, verse 12. He said, he said, he said Therefore a certain noble, ma noble man went into a far country to receive for himself a kingdom and to return and this man is Yahweh Shai, right? Verse 13, he said, and he, and he called his ten servants and delivered them ten pungs and said unto them, Occupy till I come. And the pung is what is knowledge. Occupy what be, be, be laboring, going out on the highways and byways and preaching the gospel, doing your videos, you know, going to, going, going to, going to camp, you know, go, do it, you know, being around the Akiyams, the brotherhood right you understand verse 14 but his citizen hated him and said and sent a message after him saying we will not have this man to reign over us all right and these these wicked israelites don't want you shy to rule over them right verse 15 and it came to pass that when he was returned having received the kingdom then he cometh then he commanded these servants to be called unto him to whom he have given the, the money that 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 he might know how much every man had gained in, in trading. So the most I give you this money, which is this knowledge to go and trade. We give the money, we bring in fruit. So this is what we're doing. We telling the Israelites who he is, we give them the money, which is the knowledge, and we bring in fruit to the full, to the house of Yahweh Bashem the body of Yahweh Shai. So that's how we trade and we give the knowledge, men come in. This is how we trade in, right? So you can't be hiding it. You gotta increase, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta bring in profit. You understand? You gotta bring in this. This is the most high business. You gotta bring in profit. You understand? Right? Um verse 16. Then came the first saying, Lord Yahweh Shai, thy pong had gained ten pong. And he said unto him, Well, thou good servant. Because thou hast been faithful in a very little, have thou authority over ten city, right? And these servants is the prophets, right? Verse 18, he said, And the second came, saying, Lord, Yahweh Shai, thy pong had gained five pong. And he said, Likewise to him, be thou also over five city. 
and another came saying Lord behold there is thy palm which I have kept laid up in a napkin and this with these social media prophet this slash barbershop prophet doing they lay up the most high knowledge in a napkin they're not going out on the highways and byway to let it to let the light shine in a dark place you know the DAA you know it's they you know in a little barbershop or on social media you know go out on the highways and byways do this video personal on on youtube do this video you have the knowledge you have the knowledge do the video do the work go and get with a camp right um verse um 21 for i fear thee because thou art an austere man thou takest up that which thou layest down which, which thou layest not down and reapest that thou didst not sow right he said um verse 22 and he said unto him out of thine own mouth will i judge thee thou wicked servant thou knowest that i was i was an austere man taking up that i laid not down and reaping that i did not sow he said wherefore the wherefore then givest not thou my money into the bank that at my coming i might have re require my own with usury so hey you keep your highest knowledge it ain't going to do the trading it ain't going to teach the nation of Israel the lost sheep that they are Israelite and that salvation is to them that need to repent that the name of the name of of, of who the world well, is God guide the name is Yahweh he is he exists and his son name is Yahweh Shai they didn't do those things Yahweh Shai means he's he safe he's, he's a deliverer right um verse 24 and he said unto them that that stood by take from him the pong and give it to him that had ten pong and they said unto him lord he had ten pong right for i say unto you that unto every one which had shall be given he said and for him that had not even that he had shall be taken away from him you understand so hey you don't want the most i take this knowledge away from you so do the most i work do the most i work and get those blood off your hand because this if when these wicked israelites die you're going to be responsible because you didn't warn them the most i got to hold you responsible because they didn't warn these people right um ezekiel 3 and 17 son of man i have made thee a watchman unto the house of israel therefore hear the word at my mouth and give them warning from me when i say unto the wicked thou shalt surely die and they speaking to the israelites right and thou givest not warning nor speakest to warn the wicked from his wicked way to save his life the same wicked man shall die in his iniquity but his blood will i require thine hand so the most i can require that man blood at your hand you know why because you know the truth and you didn't say nothing you had you had the knowledge of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh you know why they're in this state you know they're gonna be destroyed but don't get yourself right and you hide it you hide the light you you prefer to be in a barbershop or on social media the most I said no go on to the going to the highways and byways right verse 19 yet if thou warn the wicked and he turn not from his wickedness nor from his wicked way he shall die in his iniquity but thou hast delivered thy soul so you deliver your soul you tell them y'all are Israelite you so called Negroes Latinos and Native American Indian you confuse in the face of the Israelite you scatter among the heathen y'all are Israelite salvation is the children of Israel right the name of the heavenly father is Yahweh the name of the son is Yahweh Shai you break it down for them hey stop being wicked stop 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 turning away from fornication with going to idolatry committing adultery homosexuality lesbianism or people in that kind of wickedness right or people eating that kind of bumble meat right you rebuke them by the word with the word of yahweh hashem yahweh so when they get judged the cancer they never hear so you cleansing this blood off of your hand hey we dealing with yahweh hashem yahweh this is seriousness this is not nothing to play with you understand it's not nothing to play with right it's not nothing to play with all right 
You understand? So hey, once you once you declare this most high work, hey, you you the blood off of your hand. You understand? The blood off of your hand. Let me get this other one in um right the, the, the blood the blood off of your hand. Alright, this is Luke. Right? This is Luke 9 and 6. Alright, this is Luke chapter 9. What 26? He said, For whosoever be for whosoever shall be ashamed of me and of my words, of him shall the Son of Man be ashamed when he shall come in his own glory and his father and, and of the holy angel. So if you be ashamed of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shah, he's gonna be ashamed of you. So we gotta teach, we gotta go out on the highways and byway, and we gotta get we hand, we gotta clean we hand from all this blood. We gotta tell them what gonna happen. Is it the here at the forbear? You understand? It's either the here at the forbear, right? Um This is um Ecclesiasticus chapter four verse um twenty um um Salakia twenty three. Ecclesiastes chapter twenty chapter four verse twenty three he said and refrain not to speak and refrain not to speak right he said when there is occasion to do good and hide and hide not thy wisdom in her beauty go out on the highways and by way let us see you do this video pestle on YouTube let us see you let us see that you 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 have you have integrity you are a man with integrity you stand up for righteousness you hear this wicked demonic world we hate to throw our people because they are wicked they are in they, they are they, they, they up in our kind of philosophy and they're talking about what we dividing we dividing so-called black people and you motherfuckers in our kind of philosophies dividing your own self who's not christian who's not seven days who's not muslim who's not pentecostal you understand? But talking about we teach with our the doctrine of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai divine our people and they are in our kind of madness. So these things, these is bloods we gotta get off our hands. We gotta go and teach and get these bloods off our hand. You understand? So don't hide, don't hide your wisdom. This, this is precious. This this is poor, it's precious. Don't hide it. You understand? This is this is Ecclesiastes chapter nineteen, verse um, thirty. Salakia, Ecclesiastes chapter forty-one. Let me get forty-one. Ecclesiastes chapter forty-one, verse um, um forty-one verse. Right, you can't, you can't. Don't 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 hide don't hide this knowledge, right? Right? Yeah, Ecclesiastes chapter forty one verse fifteen. He said, "A man that hideth his foolishness is better than a man that hideth his wisdom." So a man that hide hide hideth his foolishness is better than a man that hide hide his wisdom. So don't hide this. You understand? Let Go out on the highways and byways. You understand? Make your body a living sacrifice. You understand? You understand? It pleases the most high with the foolishness of preaching to save them which believe. Right? Go out and do this work. Make your body a living sacrifice. This is First Corinthians chapter 1. First, um, um, first, um, Right. Yeah, go out and do this work. This is first Corinthians chapter one for us um verse twenty right. verse twenty one. Right, he said for after that in the in the in in the wisdom 
of Yahweh Bashem Yahushai, the world by wisdom knew it not. Yahweh Bashem Yahushai, it pleased Yahweh Bashem Yahushai by the foolishness of preaching to save them that believe. So we gotta preach this gospel. We gotta be out on the highways and byways. You gotta make your body a living sacrifice. This is Romans chapter twelve, verse one. He said, "I beseech you, brethren. I beseech you, therefore, brethren." He said, "By the mercy of Yahweh, Bashem Yahushai, that He present your bodies a living sacrifice, holy, acceptable unto Yahweh, Bashem Yahushai, which is your reasonable service." And be not conformed to this world, but be he transformed by the renewing of your mind, that he may prove that which is good and acceptable and perfect will of Yahweh Bashem Yahushai. So don't hide, don't hide your wisdom. You understand? Go out on the highways and byways and teach this gospel in sincerity and truth. You know, this 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 this, this is a this is this this is like like like, uh, like such um open rebuke. All right, you understand our ex, 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 um, extortion, right? To, to these um, to these social media slash barbershop prophets, right? Go out on the highways and byways, right? You understand and do, and do the works, right? Do the works, you understand? So we say open rebuke is better than secret love. Right, you understand? It is better. It's better than secret love. Right? Yeah, this, this is an ex exhortation. Right? This is an ex exhortation to these um these social media slash Facebook prophets. Hey, go out and do the work. You got the wisdom. Don't let your shy come back and that car you the wicked servant. Right? Teach the gospel. You know, use the ability that the Most High gave to bring forth this knowledge. You understand? And with that, I was this was edifying. I want to give our praises and honor and glory to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahushai, Bashem, Rakakodash, double honors to the apostles and elders who rule with a great stone, and a blessed sanitation to the Akiyams and the folk on the earth, pushing the gospel in sincerity and truth. Shalom.